Welcome to Overtime. I'm Nicole Dubay and joining me as always is Ted Wyman, sports editor for the Winnipeg Sun. Let's get right into it, Ted. This Sunday, the Tiger Cats are coming to Winnipeg, taking on the Blue Bombers. How do you feel about this? Well, I think it's good news for the Bombers. They've played uh, Hamilton three times already this year. They've beaten them all three times, handily the last time. Uh, you know, this is a team that was only 8 and 10, and the Bombers finished 10 and 8 in first place. This is everything they wanted. Great chance for them to get to the Grey Cup. Right, and they have to win this before they can even attempt to win the Grey Cup. I do want to mention, though, the fact that this will be the last game at Canadian Stadium. Do you think there's going to be a lot of sentiment? Not probably too much. <laughs> I mean, it's funny. It's an old building. Uh, it's been around forever. There's been a lot of great history in that building and a lot of great memories. But it's not a great building. It's kind of ramshackle over the recent years. And it's time to move on to the new stadium. There's an awful lot of excitement about it. So a lot of people will be there to say goodbye. But, uh, you know, I think that the fans would be a lot more happy about a win than saying goodbye to the stadium. Couldn't agree more. And speaking of wins, the Jets finally got one. They sure did. They had a big win against Tampa Bay Lightning to break a five-game losing streak. They got tough games coming up still this week, though, with the Washington Capitals and the Philadelphia Flyers. They've played better against good teams, so maybe they'll uh, continue that trend. Uh, I think they're, uh, they're a decent hockey team. They just have to skate, and they can do well. Couldn't agree more. As always, Ted, thanks for joining me on this week's edition of Overtime.